One. Men's soccer team finally home after a five-game road trip. They get themselves a 3-1 victory against Crosstown rival CCSU and the insurance goal by Romario Jones. And you guys have been on the road for quite some time. You had a bunch of states underneath your belt. How's it feel to be back home and get a victory? Yeah, it's feeling very good, you know, to get to get the victory back home, you know. We are in front of our home crowd and we have to get the job done. So also it's my first goal for the season, you know, my first goal for Hartford. So I'm very thankful for the goal, you know, and I'm looking forward for better things with the team. And we're looking forward to going to the conference on a good note, you know. What do you guys feel about the fact that you get the home win here, but then all of a sudden this weekend you got to pack up shop, pack your bag again and hit the road for Binghamton? Well, you know, this is just business, you know. We got to do what we got to do. We got to get back in the training and focus on the game on Saturday against Binghamton because that's going to be our first conference game. So. We just have to get that focus to get that win and start out the conference season on a good note. Congratulations on your first career goal. Congratulations on the win, and we'll keep an eye on you in Binghamton. Thanks, man. Now with the fourth-year head coach and Tom Poitras, and you know, let's go back to the beginning of the game. Uh, you guys are excited to be home and good crowd on hand. All of a sudden, they score a goal three minutes into the game, and you must have been like, oh, no. But after that, you settled on down. You even the score 15 minutes later on a Giovanni Sims goal and then eventually take the lead into the locker room 2-1. Uh, Just what was the reaction from you after the first three minutes and you're down 1-0? Well, I mean, my, my first reaction was that was their first venture into our end and the, and the kid makes a nice play and he cuts inside and he buries a great goal. You know, So credit to him. We would have liked to defend it a little better, close the space a little bit, not give him so much room. But I thought the response from our team was great. I think the guys put the ball down, they got it going again and started to get a good grip on the game and, and the pressure was coming and, and we kept going at them and going at them and eventually we were going to break them down we knew that but it was a good response to a tough situation because you never want to start that way especially at home but the guys handled it really well this is a sport where we don't keep track of time of possession but i thought throughout the entire game it really manipulated what ccsu can do against you guys especially in the second half and you eventually get that insurance goal first career goal uh, for mario jones who we just heard from but was that just it just managing the ball and it just you know kind of i guess gives them a little bit of a frustration level that rises for the Blue Devils? Yeah, no, I mean, the longer you keep the ball from someone, the more the difficult the game becomes for them. You know, and there's a lot of stats in soccer, you know, in the, at the high levels when you can record it and see it about how much time of possession. But for us, it was just a matter of, in the first half, I thought we were a little slow with the ball. You know, their team was sitting back a little bit and we were slow moving the ball. So in the second half, we moved it a lot faster. We got into the attacking third, the final third a lot more, and, and we created chances. We need to be a little more lethal still in front of the goal. But, I mean, we created the chances, and that's the most positive thing. Now it's a quick turnaround. This was uh, your final tune-up in non-conference before conference play begins. And guess what? You're back on the road again. Uh, so how do you manage this? You get the victory, but then you hit the road and start conference play against Binghamton this weekend. Well, you know, we'll, we'll recover, and we'll, we'll do things to take care of ourselves over the next day or two, you know, with the trainers and everybody else that we need to. But the biggest thing is, you know, we got to get ourselves focused for a big Binghamton game. You know, um, everybody's 0-0 zero and zero in the league right now, and we know that it's going to be a difficult game on the road so you know we we are starting to mature a little bit about being on the road you know after those five road games so hopefully that experience helps and propels us a little bit in the next game boys get a big win against crosstown rival central connecticut state 3-1 winner final tune up before conference play will be in action seven o'clock on saturday on the road at binghamton stay tuned to hartfordhawks.com for the latest